Hello, this is Rolf Agner, the trainer for SICK Incorporated. We're going to talk about the CLV 600 series of scanners. One of the biggest features about these new scanners are that we have an option for the available Ethernet. And this is a CLV uh, 600, uh, 630, 40, or 50. They're all basically the same uh, style like this. And you can see that this one has the optional oscillating mirror on top. You can see the connectors here. This is an Ethernet version where we have an industrial Ethernet connection, an M12 connector, plus our power and I.O. connector. And there's also a serial uh, version uh, which would have just a cable like this, very similar to the previous 400 series where all the information goes through a, uh, a sub-D uh, connector. Um, the, these uh, products are also available with a cloning module. And I have an example here of one of the connection boxes. Uh, I've added a couple switches here that allows me to just uh, do my training a little better to activate the inputs, but we have the cloning module, and what you get with the cloning module, in addition to storing the entire configuration of a scanner, uh, it also provides some additional inputs and outputs, which is uh, very useful sometimes. The cloning module uh, allows you to take a scanner right out of the box and hook it up to the connection device through the connector, and immediately all the uh, configuration is loaded from the cloning module to the scanner and it's able to operate without ever uh, uh, connecting to a computer in that case. Uh, we also have different focus options, that's why we have different models. 620s have a little shorter range than the 630s, the 650s have a longer range than the 630s or the 620s. There is fixed focus available, there is dynamic focus control where we can change focus settings on those that have focus control and there is also automatic focus control which is available on the 650 versions of the scanner. Uh, with the Ethernet we have web server options which give you uh, additional capability for doing diagnostics and troubleshooting remotely so we can just uh, basically log in uh, uh, through the web server and get diagnostic information over Ethernet. Uh, one thing that you can see on this uh, 650 model is we have an extra uh, connection here and that is going to be for um, the S micro SD card that we have available. What the micro SD card gives you is additional memory, and we can use that for uploading new firmware. Uh, we can store whatever you would use normal memory for. It just gives us more capability. Another nice feature of the 600 series compared to the previous 400 series scanners are that they have smart. Even the, 600, the 620 has smart, and the 630, 40, and 50 series have an advanced version of SMART uh, giving you uh, uh, higher tilt angles possible and the ability to read more damage code uh, uh, much uh, better to get higher scan rates. So those are some of the major differences. Uh, there's one more thing I forgot to mention. Let's talk about on the uh, these. We also have push buttons and those push buttons are very useful for setup. We can uh, energize a diagnostic mode, we can trigger the scanner, we can change a few functions with those buttons, and you can see here that a little hard to see now because it's not powered up, but you see that there are uh, a light scale here. LEDs that give you indication of the read quality, you know, 10%, uh, uh, 20, everyone indicates a different percentage, up to 100% read rates on the scanner. So without even hooking a computer up, you can see exactly how the scanner is doing by looking at the LEDs. So I think those are the main features of this, uh, the new Series 600, and it's a real advancement over the uh, 400 Series. The 400 Series is still available and will be for a number of years, but uh, if you want Ethernet and you want it on board, it's now available in the 600 Series. Thank you.